because, uh, fuck all of that. Remind me in five hours worth of gameplay to fucking come back there when I'm, like, level 30. Because I'm, I'm not doing it. Not doing it. It's not gonna happen. It's fun and all, but I'm going to come back with, like, two grades of weapons worth better, a shit ton more health, and a crew that can actually do damage at range. Pathfinder, I was told to expect you. Dov your cars, Chief Intelligence Officer. I want to brief you on Vold. Any questions about the planet? Ask away. I got a, I've got a map. A few treasure hunters found this map of ancient Vold. They wanted you to have it. We thought we lost this when the dark burned. Look at that detail. With this map, we could plan attacks through old trade routes, ones even the Ked don't know about. Whoever gave this to you deserves our thanks. As do you. All right. I think I have enough. You're welcome, bud. If you need anything else, I'll be here. It's a cool fight and all, but man, it's like those dragons in Inquisition where it's just like, you could fight them at any level you want, and then you'll find them often in early level areas. But if you even dare attack them, you'll just get fucking splattered against the wall. You saved lives today. We don't know who or how many, but you did. Oh, I set something aside for you from our latest shipment. For your help. Hey, thanks. That's real nice of you. It's dangerous out there. Everyone relies on their gear to get them home. Applies to you too. Oh, and Yetta, the fighter you found, managed to make her way back. She's stable and recuperating, thanks to you. Oh, there's that the resistance. Oh my god, it's a lot of consumables. None of which I'm probably gonna end up using, but thank you. I guess. Let's just pick up this quest marker. I'm probably not gonna do it because, like, I'm tired of old, and like I said, I'll come back here later. Let me get really close to you. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it! We have to concentrate on saving the Moshai, Anna, not your vain hopes. Rabba, I know Moshai's still alive. Anna, why are you convinced your friend's still alive? Because Moshai is our best sabotage. She knows how to keep herself safe. We destroyed a cast weapon depot, but the detonators failed. Masha had to set off the explosives by hand. It put her in the middle of a blast they saw from over the hills. But Masha knows demolition like no one else. She knows the safest place to hide. All right, it's possible. If your friend is as skilled as you say, it's possible she survived. Thank you. I've been shouting for so long and no one has listened but you. Even if I believed you, <coughs> you to go out there. We're needed elsewhere. If I'm out there, I could survey the area. Would you? Sky blessed. I've got the nav point. I hope the data is compatible with your um gadget. Whatever you find, please tell me. I just want the truth. <laughs> yeah, sorry, you're gonna have to um Man, they have just turned into a smoker. <clears throat> you have to do that yourself. I'm, I'm getting off this ice ball. See ya, suckers! I'm getting the fuck off this world. I've, I've had it up to here with freezing my tits off in this fucking armor. It's starting to chafe. Getting out of here. Oh, you think I'd make a good deal, like See ya. I don't care. I don't care about your... your fucking missing scouts, or you're missing researchers. I'll get back to them eventually, I promise. Pinky promise. Expect, expect me in three weeks, I'll be back, but not right now. Not right here. Right now, right now I'm leaving. I'm getting out of here. Peace.
All right. PB's been looking for you. Yeah, we gotta talk to a lot of people now, actually. Um, I need to go back to Aya at some point. Well, preferably soon. We'll we'll, we'll talk to everybody on board. Um. Nah, -uh -uh, no peeking. I'm putting the finishing touches on my personal project. I thought you said it was on the Nexus. I'm just perfecting the final component here. Or should I say, trying to. What are you working on? Several of the crew have offered to help, and I keep politely declining and ushering them out. So, thank you for retrieving that critical piece of Remtech. But kindly, stop digging. Um, no, can't help it. I'm naturally curious. And I'm sure the crew just wants to bond. Curious is good. Builds anticipation. I'll leave the bonding to you. Not my style. I realize it must be hard being the Pathfinder and not being able to know everything. I'm working on it. But there's so much you can do that no one else can. It's safe to say that you, my friend, are one of a kind. I don't have to explain genetics to you, do I? Everyone is one of a kind. <laughs> <sighs> yes, yes. Assuming you're not a clone. But no more distractions. Even then clones have different handprints, because we learned that in Citadel. Well, 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 well. Come by? And I'll unveil it. Now, if you will, please leave me to my own devices. Alright. Get no argument from me, PB. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. I do have AVP outstanding. I never get out and deal with you guys. <laughs> Maybe for the best. I've got enough people to patch up without Gil tripping over Karkins. Not the backup I was hoping for, Nexi. Not exactly a field agent, Gil. All right. Collect reward. Boom. All right. Let us find what we want. Ooh, market dominance. Special items, 100%. Copper, graphite, nickel. Let's go ahead and sell all our scrap, which is quite a bit. My god. Any of that magic, magic metal? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Um, I was also going to sell those pistol mods, wasn't I? Since I'm never going to carry pistols and you can't break them down for parts. Uh, along with sniper mods. Awesome. Uh, R&D center. Melee weapons. Zari 2. Oh, there, I do have a Zari 3. Needs 30 Verandium. Oh, it needs more than the other one. But look at that. Four Aug slots. Four Aug slots on the third tier. Dude. Two, three Augmentation slots and 506 melee damage. That's 200 more than I currently have. So fucking badass. How you doing, Lexi? Feeling okay? Um, yeah, doing all right. I'll let you get back to it. I'll be here if you need me. Actually, I read something. Um, apparently, in the codex under Journey So Far, writer, you could read your own psych profile. Yeah, read a more thorough evaluation. I've observed you display a tendency towards analytical thinking and intellectual curiosity when interact with others, even difficult personalities. You consider more grounded and non-emotional responses. However, I would say that it, all this is at odds with your tendency to act impulsively in many situations. You go with your gut instead of waiting for more information. Although you've had to quickly adjust to take on new expected roles, you maintain a direct and professional demeanor. I guess that your former military training and subsequent experiences with command structures is serving you well here. Hmm. Nice. That's not a bad psych profile at all. I mean, this right here in the middle... It's not great, but 
Could be worse. I could be a psychopath. Oh, where's the lieutenant at? Lieutenant! No hiding from me. Core is down in the cargo bay. Vetra and Dracker down in the crew bay together. Um, we also need to... Where is it? Yeah, I need to call Evra. We'll go to Aya first and then we'll call Evra. I keep putting off calling Evra, but it's just my nature. I just don't want to do it, man. I don't like talking to people. Pathfinder. Hey, I was wondering, could you put your stamp on a project? It's for me and Jarl to work on. Call it diplomacy if you have to put it in a budget bucket. Greenlight that research and it's all good. Okay. We'll talk later. I know it. Apparently. Where's Jarl at? Oh, he's down in engineering. Liam's armor requisition blueprint. Wait. What? Allies and relationships. Oh, I also need to go back to the... Yeah. Oh my god. Liam Costa. Armor diplomacy. Build his research project. Oh, it's not under development. It's not under research. It's under development. Of course it is. Development. Special items. Armor requisition. Oh, that's fucking easy. That ain't, that ain't nothing, man. Ten iron? And, um... Ten aluminum? We're swimming in the shit, man. Could have built that yourself. Saved me some time. And you both have... Biotics? Oh, hey! That's how it's said. Yep. So, sorry, Biotics, for a few hundred thousand of your enemies. Humans are catching up. I was wondering about that, about how Joel would react to biotics since I don't think his people have it. Liam, I signed off on that project. Um that's great, Pathfinder. Jal and we got our gear. Costa? Ryder. We don't technically have uniforms, but this is a little casual. <laughs> Just convenience, swapping armor. You ready to go? Go. Right. The pattern on your pauldron? Family honorific. Can I wear the poncho? It's a rough shield. <laughs> and no. Why? Is it religious? Wait. What? It's personal. You're not allowed. Because of status or species? Maybe it's both. Mm, do all humans look alike? Some of you sound alike. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the fuck are you guys doing? What is going on? I thought this was about armor. Are you deliberately trying to offend Jarl? Uh, of course he is. That's the point. Asking stuff diplomats leave out. Armor for answers. I, my turn was earlier. Nexus info packets leave a lot out. Um... I am sorry. Was this not sanctioned? Oh, you weaseling Adi. Nevertheless. Right, huh? Jarl's technically an emissary. There's no way this kind of questioning would fly with his superiors. He won't tattle if that's what you're worried about. This was between us. We were joking around and realized we didn't know how to insult each other. Or how not to. Some things are so ingrained, they're invisible. We didn't even know the warning signs, so we got it over with. Now we won't do it accidentally. Like when we're trying to negotiate an outpost. Enough of his people want to shoot us now. That's actually a good point. Okay, I kind of get the intent. No harm, no foul. If Jar was offended, I'd be on the floor. I'll take that kind of honest any day. We have a lot to learn. That's a good point. The Angara are better now than when people's lives are on the line. Super open about their emotions, and had you actually pissed off Jar, he probably would have suplexed you. How you doing, Lieutenant? Hi there. Um, nothing to talk about. Oh, that's right. You wanted to go to Eos. I'll be here. Oh shit. 
Sorry, we had to go back for a number of reasons. Okay. So, so on the to-do list, back to Aya. Yes? I'll see you later, John. Stay strong and clear. So the plan is go to Aya and drop off those couple of things that we have. Then call Ephra and see what he wants. And then if we have time, head back to Eos, because there's a few things we got to do there, amongst a number of other things. You know, there was a time when Sid was afraid of space. We were traveling a lot, and one day she just woke up and realized there was nothing outside the shuttle walls. Happened more than once. She panicked. I'd hold her for as long as it took. She doesn't even remember now. It was only for a month or two. Funny, huh? The things they don't remember. Hmm. And you feel like it's up to you to hold on to it, or else it's just gone. And there's just something there that you know you're missing. Drac? Just hold on to it. Are Drac's kids dead? That's an interesting... We've already done this one. Taboom. We need to do a scientific test. Drive core devices. No need to know anything about the drive core. Just the stress test. Profanity deleted by InfoBoard VI. Agitating verbing nouns gill. Name of the VI learns to censor all language. I'm making you program it. Jaw thinks it's very educational. Alright. I need to check my email. It's good to see the, the crew be casual with each other sometimes. Mail from Angara HQ from Ephra. Words reach me that you've found a pre-scourge in Garn AI and you chose to keep it for yourself. Yeah, I guess I did. Okay. Confidential Fold Intelligence. It's your liberation. Labor camp. Okay. Is this a joke from Cash? Not a joke, Kesh. It's not a joke. However, it may be one of the worst decisions that I've made so far. In hindsight, probably should have just killed the damn thing. You have AVP outstanding pathfinder. I do not. I do have or have strike teams ready for deployment. Unless I had two perks, I don't think I did. Hey, starting to get silver materials. Trait gain, rugged, nice. Still can't do anything from here. I guess. I mean, I don't really know. Perform surgical strike. Send strike team. Fifty-fifty. Fifty-fifty. You could take it, Oscar. I believe in you. Identify spy. This is up your alley. Your uh, alley. Materials. Silver material loot box. Some copper. The. Some credits. And some chitin. Ended up getting sixty-six. Sixty-six credits, which is not a lot, actually. All right, back to Aya. Not really a holiday destination. Not really, but it's a lot more livable than it was before. God, there's so many places to explore. 
So many activities! I still don't find that science team that got sent out. I don't quite know where to look for it though. I guess it's probably just explore around a little bit. I'll probably find it. I can feel the scourge's drag on the ship. At least it keeps Aya hidden. It could destroy the planet though. You know that, right? 